क्लास फाइव सोशल स्टडीज टर्म वन लेसन नंबर थ्री फॉरेस्ट एंड वाइल्ड लाइफ लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव इन दिस लेसन यू विल लर्न अबाउट आर फॉरेस्ट वेल्थ वाइल्ड लाइफ कंजर्वेशन ऑफ फॉरेस्ट कंजर्वेशन ऑफ वाइल्ड लाइफ Name any six trees found in Indian forests: mahogany, ashoka, gulmohar, peepal, banyan, arjuna. Introduction. India has a large collection of plants and wild animals. Nearly eight percent of total number. of species in the world are found in india plants are very important for us life will not be possible without plants many types of plants and creepers growing on the soil are collectively called as vegetation wildlife includes both plants and animals found in the forest the plants of a particular region are called flora and the animals of the particular region are called fauna a forest wealth vegetation and wildlife are one of the most valuable resources in our country we have only One fifth area under forests. We get a large variety of things from forests. These include timber, fuel wood, bamboo, pulp, resin, honey, silk, lac, gum, and many more. Timber. is the most useful product it is widely used for building houses furniture tools and railway sleepers wood pulp is used for making papers trees are the main source of food for living beings they give oxygen to breathe the distribution of forest is mostly influenced by the amount of rainfall in our country the distribution of rainfall is highly uneven and so is the distribution of forests evergreen forests in hot and very wet parts of india especially along the mountain slopes there is dense growth of trees with many creepers these trees do not shed their leaves and remain green throughout the year these are the evergreen forests the trees grow tall and close to each other that the sun rays do not reach the ground rosewood ebony and mahogany are the main types of trees grown here they produce valuable hardwood such forests are found along the western ghats and in northeastern states of india deciduous forests deciduous forests are the monsoon forests found in large parts of india there are many trees that shed their leaves in the deciduous forest shisham teak and sal are the important and valuable trees in these forests such forests are found in the shivalik ranges and also in the southern plateaus tigers lions elephants langurs and monkeys are the common animals found in these forests thorny forests 
or desert forests. Some parts of our country are very dry. Here, the forests have thorny bushes. Babul and Kikar are the main trees and are widely scattered. In desert areas, the plants have deep roots to draw water from great depths. These forests are found in the Great Indian Desert and parts of the Deccan Plateau. Camel, wild ass are the common animals found in this region. Coniferous or mountain forests. Many parts of the Himalayan mountain ranges are covered with the dense forests. Here the trees are straight and tall. The leaves are pointed and the trees bear cones. These are the coniferous forests. Sheer and deoda are the main trees. The wood of these trees is soft and useful. Silver fox mink polar bear are the common animals found here mangrove forests on the sea coasts or deltas of large rivers silt is deposited by floods or tidal waves of oceans this encourages growth of dense vegetation these forests are called Tidal forests. These types of forests are found in Sundarbans in West Bengal and on the deltas of Godavari, Krishna, and Mahanadi. Sundari is the name of trees in mangrove forests, which give its name to Sundarbans. Tigers one-horned rhinoceros are found here. Conservation of forests Due to the fast increase in population of our country, there is an increase in need for wood and other things that we get from forests. We have been cutting trees for various purposes. Destroying the forests is called deforestation. Deforestation causes soil erosion and landslides. Keeping in view the importance of forests, many movements have been started to conserve forests. Chipko is the forest conversation movement. It was started by the people of Uttarakhand. It was called Chipko because the people of the village refused to allow trees to be cut down by hugging them. Social forestry is another movement. Vana Mahotsav is celebrated in the beginning of the rainy season. Trees are planted along roads, streets, railway lines, and canals. Children take great interest in it. They plant and look after the trees. This activity's motto is a tree for every child. Wildlife. Forests are the home to the variety of wildlife. There are thousands of species of animals and large variety of reptiles, amphibians, mammals, birds, insects and worms which dwell in the forest. Tiger The tiger is our national animal. It is found in various parts of the country. Gir forest in Gujarat is the home of Asiatic lions. Elephant and one-horned rhinoceros. 
elephant and one horned rhinoceros roam in the forests of assam elephants are also found in kerala and karnataka kaziranga national park in assam is a sanctuary with one horned rhinoceros while periyar sanctuary in kerala is home of elephants camel and wild asses camels and wild asses are found in the great indian desert and the run of kutch wild goats and leopards wild goats snow leopards and bears are found in the himalayan region snakes there are several hundreds of species of snakes found in india cobras and crates are important among them besides these many other animals are found in our country such as monkey wolf jackal nilgai cheetah and others bird sanctuaries india is equally rich in bird life the peacock is our national bird other common birds are parrots pigeons myna geese bulbul and ducks there are several bird sanctuaries which have been created to give birds their natural habitat these provide the birds protection from hunters the bharatpur bird sanctuary in rajasthan is a home to a large number of birds conservation of wildlife due to cutting of forests and hunting several species of wildlife in india are declining rapidly many species have already become extinct the government has started project tiger and project elephant to protect these animals you can also contribute in conserving wildlife you can refuse to buy things made from parts of the bodies of animals such as their bones horns fur skins and feathers every year we observe wildlife week in the first week of october to create awareness of conserving the habitats of the animal kingdom outline forests are very large areas where trees grow close to one another the plants of a particular region are called flora the animal of a particular region are called fauna the distribution of forests is mostly influenced by the amount of rainfall there are five types of forests evergreen deciduous thorny coniferous and mangrove trees are planted along roads streets railway lines and canals elephants are also found in kerala and karnataka forests are the home to a variety of wildlife kindly help our effort by liking sharing and subscribing to our channel please press the bell icon to get more of such videos thank you